Hey, what's up guys? This is just a quick KitOps tutorial on showing you how you can apply all of the KitOps modifiers to an object so that you can create a single mesh out of it. So let's get started. I'm going to quickly add some rather complex cutters to our scene. By the way, a, a quick tip. If you have one of these KitOps inserts applied and you add another one, it won't apply it to the insert. It'll apply it to the object the insert is is connected to. So you can see that's what this is doing right here. Turn these off and see this is the actual object that we now have created. So what we want to do is we want to apply all these cutters. So let's show a couple ways of doing this. So here's our object, some kind of weird, <laughs> weird construct as you can see. The first way is that we just select the object and you can look in here and I can actually start at the very top and I can start applying modifiers, or if I have the preferences set up to turn on the modifier tools, I'll have this button that says apply all. Now, when I click this button, you'll see that it's taking its time. Now it's applied all the modifiers and we have our object, but we also have all of our modifiers. So how do we get rid of the modifiers? Well, we go over to the inserts right here. That's where we stored all of them right click on it and we're going to say delete hierarchy and now we have our object our single object that i can tab into select all and you can see that it's all set up okay so let's go back and let's take a look at this again okay let's take a look at another way that we can apply all the modifiers one of the ways that we can do that is by selecting our object and we can just go in and apply each one of these individually from the top on down if we don't have this plugin installed that will work also, but it may take some time. As you can see, there's a lot of modifiers applied here. Let's skip that for right now, and let's instead show you yet a third way of doing it. And that is we go into the object, and we say apply, and we say visual geometry to mesh. And once we've done that, I can hit the tab button and hit A, and you'll see that we have applied them all. And tab back out, and again, if you recall, we can just go right over in the inserts collection and say delete hierarchy and it'll get rid of all of those. So those are three different ways of applying the modifiers and getting rid of the inserts for a KitOps object. So now we have turned it into a mesh. And as you can imagine, because it's a mesh, we can start to edit it however we want to. So you'll note when you use this technique, you're going to get a list of all of the modifiers and they'll be tagged red, meaning it can't find the inserts because we just deleted them. So what we need to do now is actually go through and delete all these, which you can do by pressing the X button, or you can just say, delete all here, remove all modifiers. So that's something you need to be aware of. Okay, thanks for watching.